week we're talking about animal print in the office. Animal print, and especially leopard print, has become such a commonplace in fashion now that it's not at all the statement it once was. But there are still rules. I think most of us would naturally shy away from wearing leopard print to a job interview. Unless, of course, it was, you know, for an exotic dancer job or something. But generally, it's a no. But once you've got your feet under the desk, I think you can perfectly well wear animal print to work these days, as long as you observe a few rules. I think, essentially, the old adage that you shouldn't ever show both cleavage and legs, you should kind of add leopard print, animal print to that list. I think if you show one of the three, that's enough. So once you've got your leopard on, put the rest of it away. Um, beyond that, I say go for it. I mean, I don't even think there's any problem with double leopard. I'm double leoparding today, as you can see, uh, with this t-shirt and these shoes. I do try and draw the line at a triple leopard, which has been known. Um, I think that's probably overdoing it. So we've got a range of office appropriate animal print to show you, starting with this. Um, Mark by Mark Jacobs leopard print in a kind of nice bleached out monochrome that makes it look a little bit more office appropriate and no split because I think again that would be overdoing it with the leopard. Secondly, Gucci snake print silk t-shirt which I think with uh, a very simple black skirt or trousers looks rather uh, smart for the office and a little bit scary which is never a completely bad thing. Giraffe print trousers, now that's something that sounds a lot scarier than it looks in real life because that's actually quite a chic summer office appropriate pair of trousers, I think. Now depending on the environment, this blouse could be pushing the envelope a little bit too far, but not necessarily, especially if you keep the buttons done up. Wearing knitwear to the office can sometimes look a little bit beta, I think, um, which is why combining that with animal print, which is by its nature a little bit intimidating, can be no bad thing. This is Stella McCartney. Leopard on the front with a contrasting check on the back. And finally, very sensible, office appropriate piece of zebra print from DKNY, made very civilised by this navy t-shirt neckline and a very, very sensible hemline. <laughs> <laughs>